Ready to buy crypto but not sure how to get started? I got you. Welcome to Money Class Monday. I'm Brittany Castro, CFP, founder of Financially Wise Inc. Make sure to hit the subscribe button to access all the new videos as they drop. So when you're ready, you can open up your own account on one of the exchanges. So there's exchanges such as Coinbase, Gemini, and BlockFi. When you open the account, then you add money into that account, and then you decide which crypto you actually want to purchase. So once you get started and develop your own crypto philosophy and your overall risk tolerance, you might decide to transfer your money off of the exchange into one of your own wallets. Now there's things called a hot wallet and a cold wallet. So a hot wallet basically refers to a cryptocurrency wallet that is still connected to the internet versus a cold wallet is basically a cryptocurrency wallet that is not connected to the internet. So a cold wallet means you actually take your coins or whatever positions you're holding off of the exchange and you put it into this like cold wallet and you keep it that way and you manage it and store it that way. So generally speaking, cold storage is the most secure, um, more secure than the hot wallet. But you have to kind of, again, figure out where do you fall on the spectrum and what is your overall risk tolerance for owning your crypto. Now, when you own your own wallet, the most important thing to do is set it up correctly and make sure you protect your private key. So your private key is basically like your email password. You need to remember it, keep track of it, and it, keep it safe. Now, definitely watch some videos on how to set up your wallets correctly because it's extremely important. You don't wanna risk losing your crypto and you don't wanna risk losing your private key and all of that information. Now remember, some exchanges like BlockFi actually offer yields or loans against your crypto portfolio if you hold it on their exchange. So again, that's something you have to decide if you want that, right? Like what is your philosophy with crypto? Are you trying to hold it? Are you trying to just buy and sell it, make some profit? Do you wanna take it off a line and into your cold storage, AKA your cold wallet? All of it is up to you. Now remember, crypto is extremely volatile, so you need to review your entire investment and financial strategy and ensure you're investing only what you feel comfortable with and you know the risks involved. Finally, be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel so you never miss a video and we're talking a lot about crypto, so hopefully it'll help educate you. I'll see you next time. Boom.